penalty to the women. So the men have to retreat 30 yards. And Amanda Paul brings the penalty in. Going towards her is Patrick Quigley. Look at that pass from Amanda. Can somebody make good of it? Katie Reed riding very hard with Luke Merrick. Luke couldn't get the shot onto it. Can Minnie turn it? She gets a little touch, and then she puts it right into the middle. There's Amanda. She just needs to cut the backhand. Didn't make contact. Minnie's going to have a go at it. Minnie does make contact. It's right there. Can someone turn onto it? Luckily for the men, Luke Merrick was there, but he's been ridden out of it by uh, Katie Reed. Katie back on for this chucker. Luke doing well. Luke brings the ball up uh, over the halfway line for the men. The number one, though, Katie is riding. Not going to give him any peace at all. Amanda's going to go and help out. That's a good little centering shot from Luke to Roger. Roger takes it forward. Well played, Roger. A couple of shots from Roger, but Minnie. Oh, Roger wins the ride off. Crikey, not many people win a ride off against Minnie. Unfortunately, Roger had done all the hard work winning the ride off, but he couldn't hit the ball between the posts. Let off for the ladies. All right, hit in. Other side, Mini. Even I could see where that went out. All right, team's coming to the right side of the field. Mini to bring it in. Mini is riding Tarzan for this chucker. Here she comes at speed. She's got Katie waiting for the pass. It comes in front of her. Mini, though, coming at speed. Katie's going to come in front. Well played, Katie. Luke Merrick trying to ride her off. Luke just. Cancels the ball. Look at, oh, Amanda took her eye off the ball. She turned quickest, though, got the backhand away. Well played, Amanda. We've got some girls running down the line now, but Luke's there. Luke gets a good backhand this time, turning onto it. Patrick Quigley crosses the line to get there, but he's got away with it. Nobody coming down hard enough. Patrick on the near side. He's getting pressure from Amanda Poor. Patrick couldn't continue his run. Margot's over the top of it. Here comes uh, Katie Reed. Katie gets the backhand. Can Minnie put pressure on to Luke? Yes, she can. Come on, Minnie. Put some more pressure on him. Luke doing really well with that, though. Luke turning the ball. He's going to try and get it across the field. Luke's done extremely well, but he's just gone a little further than I think he wanted to. Is he going to back the ball into the middle? No, he's going to slow down and try and get control of it. He has. He's got Minnie in his way, but Luke's coming through again. Luke sends the ball towards the back line and over the back well wide good pressure from the men in this opening part of the third chucker mini brings it in good push in by her nice up the field she'll get past roger easily oh why has she done that she was called off it and patrick Tries to get a hold of it. Luckily, Amanda was wise to that. Gets it back up to Minnie. Minnie's not going to try and make a move on Luke. Luke gets the backhand. It comes across the field. Amanda's going to get there. Rides out Sam Clements. Well played, Amanda. Minnie, your line. Get to it. Roger's going to put some pressure on her. Now Minnie tries the backhand. Amanda's got it. She can go across the field. Well played, Amanda. Now she's got another chance. Amanda Poor gets... Oh, comes off her cane. Didn't get the angle. Certainly got the distance. Can she back it into the middle from there? It's difficult to do. And I guess it's gone over the back line, so it'll be a hit into the men. And Luke Merrick to bring it in. Trying to see if he's got a white shirt without a marker on it. He brings the ball in, comes off. Katie Reed. Katie keeping an eye on him, though. Now Katie's going to move over towards Luke. Bumps him off pretty well. Lots of people going in there all at once, though. Could be a bit of a melee. It looks like a two-on-one. Luke's certainly asking for it. He's not going to get it, though. Sam Clements has got the ball at the moment. Sam gets it off the boards. Minnie Keating there quickly. Lovely shot from Minnie. Can anyone turn on to it? It looks like Luke Merrick's got there. He got a little touch. But Amanda Poor gets the better backhand and puts it in front of Margot. Margot now taking off towards goal. Margot getting ridden out by Sam Clements. Sam tries the backhand. Doesn't work out. Margot goes for the under the neck. Doesn't quite get the angle. Over the back line again. Another hit in two. The men. Luke Merritt looking upfield. Taps it in. He's got two of his white fellows over here. 
He goes for the big shot, didn't really connect. He's got another go at it. He's got uh, Katie, well played Katie. Absolute cracking game. Amanda does him, fishes for it, turns it beautifully. Patrick comes right across her, gets away with that. Amanda's still got the ball. Luke trying to get in there. Nobody can get it at the moment. Katie trying to put pressure on to Sam Clements, takes it up the field for the men. Sam doesn't get the second shot. Amanda's there again for the women. Can Amanda turn it? Yes, she can. Now Amanda's got the right direction towards goal. She gets hooked, though, right at the last minute by Luke. Ball's there. Minnie Keating picks it up on the near side. She's asking for a penalty, doesn't get it. Who got that on the near side? Is that Amanda pushing it forward still? Crikey, these women are playing hard. And I heard a whistle for sure that time, so the clock will stop. Just under two minutes to go. I thought I heard a whistle. No, maybe not. Start the clock again. Luke Merrick brings the ball in with a hit in. Just tapping it again. He's looking to try and find somebody. Patrick's making a move towards the middle. He's now playing it on the near side. Katie's doing brilliant again. Little mighty squirrel. Absolutely living up to her name. Roger. Roger gets a good shot away for the men. Minnie's not happy. Minnie at speed. Going to hook his stick. She does. But we got Luke Merrick on the near side. Luke, that's looking good. But Margot's there. Can she get the backhand? She got a bit. And Amanda clears the line for the girls. They all had a go at it. Amanda's turned really quickly. She's stolen it away from Luke. Amanda's still going. She's got Katie backing her up. Katie gets the ball. Not enough of it. Here comes Margot. Not enough of it. And... I think that was Patrick Quigley gets a little backhand. Minnie on the near side. Little backhand from her. There's it for Roger again. Replay. Roger attacking the goal. Minnie moving across towards him. Amanda and Luke Merrick. It's going wide at the moment. And I think uh, Amanda's going to shepherd that out over the back line. Let it go out. They're going to turn the ball up forward now. Crikey, this is almost half time already. Can Minnie get the ball in? She's going to have to play it. She wants to get it up the field quickly because the 30-second bell's going to go in a second. Move it up there, Minnie. Look at that. She's going to pass it to Katie. Unfortunately, Katie let her horse go over the top of it. Amanda Paul picks it up. Amanda towards the middle. Sam Clements going with her. Look at that lofted shot from Amanda. Go, Katie, your line. Margot's going too. Who's got it? Luke gets a little backhand for the men. Turns it away. There's Amanda Poor onto it first. She's got a bit of time. She takes it, sends the ball up towards the men's goal. Who's on it now? Good backhand from Sam Clements away from the danger zone with a second to go. It's on the boards, and that will end the third chucker. It is half time. What a game we got going. They are running up and down. I love the fact that in polo, the men and the women compete on an even ground. It's one of the very few sports in the world that this can happen. All right, half time, ladies and gentlemen. Time to tread in, divot stomp. Please make it out to the field. Make it as flat as you can. Get your door entry forms in. 